hey guys in this video I'm going to teach you how to fix the Visual Studio code issue in Mac like uh, once you install Visual Studio in your Mac and when you start uh, running and authenticating your org in Salesforce you get a Java error so most of the time there will be Java path issue which uh, I will tell how to fix that Java path and if Java is not supported like uh, if you have upgraded your Mac it will have 14 Java 14 but Visual Studio is supporting only 8 and 11 Java 8 and 11 so 8 you will not be able to install in Mac because Mac is having some security so you better go and install 11.0.7 uh, so you can just install Java from here and uh, it will take you through the, some steps just click next 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 and Java will be installed and then what you have to do is uh, you can yeah you already have VS code so um, this is uh, if you see this is a, a VS code uh, so in uh, VS code what we have to do is uh, uh, we just have to go to code references and setting once you come to setting search apex here just type apex and then you go down and uh, here you find the java path so uh, this path you have to put whatever you are setting java home in your uh, laptop macbook that you have to paste it here sometime it will have the default one with comma and all that you have to remove and uh, most of the time it will have the uh, java 14 which is by default installed in your mac if you have upgraded so you have to change this so let's go back to the console and see how you can set the java path after installing um, jdk 11 so if you see here in my laptop and uh, if I put uh, this Java version, see uh, you can see the Java version 11 is already installed. So once you install Java, you just type Java space hyphen version. So it will tell you which version of Java you have. So after after that you have to uh, see if Java home is set or not so you can just type ECHO space dollar Java home and see so this is the path which I have set I will tell you how to set the path so after uh, this you can just copy this and paste it in VS code the issue will be fixed but now you have installed Java you don't have the Java home setup so how you set up the Java home is you just simply do ls hyphen al so so uh, there was some spelling mistake ls al so if you do ls hyphen al you will see one one file here dot bash profile so some time if you have uh, means install the java if the java home is not set this file will not be there so what you have to do is you just have to type this command t u c h dot bash underscore profile okay so uh, if you do this you will be able to create dot bash profile so I, I already have I'm not going to run this command so once you do that um, yeah once you do that you have to open this uh, file right so um, this there is a command called open it's already there open hyphen e dot bash profile this will open another window where you have to put the java path so you have to write all these things which i will put it in uh, my comment section so in description you can copy paste you just change this uh, path up to home so library java java virtual machine and this jdk contents and home so you just change this and rest all you can keep like that once you put this copy paste close this after closing you have to type uh, the another command to save the uh, change which you have done so there is a secure 
so yeah the source space tilde hyphen dot bash dot profile if you run this command that java path will be saved whatever you edited the dot bash pro profile it will save so you just run this command and java home will be set so you can go back and uh, just echo java home you will be able to see the java path is set you are done this much you just have to do this much and then you can go and run your vs code uh, uh, yeah don't forget to copy this and uh, paste it here and once you paste this is auto saved so it will be automatically saved and then you can go ahead and uh, run any of your uh, class execute anything deploy any project it will work without any issue if you face any issue you can comment to my video below i will try to help you Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.